Hey guys, the objective of this video is to draw an axial force diagram, a shear force diagram, and a bending moment diagram for a beam. So the problem we've been given is we've got this beam, it's supported at two points. This is a roller joint, this is a pin joint, and we have a 10 newton force acting here, a 5 newton force acting here, and a 2 newton per meter um, uniformly distributed load acting over this length of 6 meters. So our first step, as always, is going to be to draw our shear force to draw our um, bent our sorry our free body diagram. So what I've done is I've just drawn our free body diagram here. I've drawn in our reaction. So we've got two reactions here because we have a pin joint, and we have one reaction here because we have a roller joint. So what we're going to be doing is we're going to be applying our equilibrium equations to solve for these three unknown forces. So we'll start off by applying the equilibrium equation in the x direction. So setting that equal to zero, we end up with this force here minus this force here. So then we can solve for bx and we find that bx is five newtons. And I've just drawn a little arrow to the left to show the direction in which it's acting in. So our next step will be to solve for a moment to isolate one of the forces. So we'll take the moment about a let that equal to zero, we have this 10 newton force acting at a lever arm of two meters from A, and it's causing a positive anti-clockwise rotation. Then we have this UDL, of the magnitude is going to be two times six, and its lever arm is half this distance, which is three meters, and this causes a negative rotation. Uh, then the last force, which will contribute a moment, will be this BY. So BY multiplied by the lever arm, and again, that's causing a